Good evening, wherever this finds you. Welcome to the 68th Emerging Growth Conference, day two of our two-day super virtual investor conference. I'm Anna Berry. Just a few notes. Today, we're running until 5 p.m. Eastern. Now, when we switch to the next company, you might see a black screen for a moment. That's just us moving over to the next presenter. Of course, if you experience downtime for more than a minute or two, refresh your browser. Everything should work properly again. And our platform does work best on Google Chrome. So if you're watching from an Apple device, you have to hit the play button to start the session. Now, all of our conferences, they're uploaded to our Emerging Growth Conference YouTube channel. So please subscribe, youtube.com slash Emerging Growth Conference. Now, today, during each company's presentation, you, our viewer, can submit questions through the webcast module, and we will attempt to address as many of these at the end of the presentation. And one last note, after today's event, you'll be redirected to our registration page for our next conference. So stay on or come back to reserve your spot early. Let's begin with Qantasing Group Limited, trades on the NASDAQ under the symbol QSG and is a leading online service provider in China dedicated to improving people's quality of life and well-being by providing lifelong personal learning and development opportunities. Happy to welcome the Chief Financial Officer, Tim Shia. Nice to see you. Good evening to you, Tim. Thanks for joining us. Uh, thank you, Anna. Thank you for having me. Uh, good evening. Good, good morning. Good morning to Anna and everyone. And I'm glad to meet you here. And uh, the following time, I will uh, deliver my uh, presentation based on the slides you may see. Uh, shall I start? Yes, please start. The floor is yours and call me when you're ready for questions. Yeah, okay. Uh, I will spend around 20 minutes to uh, elaborate based on the slides. And if, if you guys have any questions, uh, I will answer following that. Uh, so the first, uh, this you can maybe see the slides. This is a standard disclaimer because we are a NASDAQ listed company. Uh, so all of the information I just I will uh, deliver will be based on the uh, facts and written materials. And if you have any further questions, uh, you may uh, dig into more for uh, to search the information for our written material and also the publications. Uh, okay, I will go uh, the next. As just mentioned by Anna, uh, Quantasing is our mission is to improve people's quality of life and well being by providing them with lifelong personal learning and development opportunities. Uh, Quantasing is a young company, though we listed in the US uh, on the US market. Uh, we have just launched our business since uh, July 2019. So currently, we are the largest online learning company uh, catering to the uh, online people, uh, adult people's learning uh, uh, needs. And we, uh, we are the largest in terms of the revenue in 2022. Uh, so this is uh, these slides. Uh, is a glance for our uh, financial figures. Uh, so this is the latest information as we just uh, posted uh, this uh, morning uh, in the US town. And for the latest quarter uh, in the uh, fiscal year of 2024, uh, that is uh, uh, the last calendar quarter in 2023. Uh, so this is, you can see uh, our revenue reached uh, Retail number of over uh, RMB 980.5 million uh, with uh, 20, nearly 25% year on year growth. And also our uh, net income uh, reached over 100 million RMB. And also uh, as of the end of uh, December 31st, 2023, our total registered users reached over 100 and one uh, twelve point four million. Uh, also, for because we are a learning company, so our major business is uh, is to our major business model is to collect the uh, tutoring uh, fees from our learners. Uh, as such, uh, our gross billions of individual online learning services uh, reached the amount of nearly ninety uh, nine hundred and forty four point. 6 million RMB uh, in the latest quarter. And also at the end of last year, our cash reserves, including the cash, 
cash equivalent and short-term investments uh, reached over 1,050.8 million RMB. Uh, that is nearly 150 uh, US, uh, million US dollars. And also in the latest quarter, our paying learners uh, reached over 0 0.4 million uh, with a 24.2% uh, uh, year-on-year growth. So this is the first glance for our uh, financials. And also, uh, this is our market. Uh, we are the largest online learning platform uh, for the adult learning. Uh, we tailor-made our uh, contents and the courses for the uh, Chinese mass public. So we, we have a large user uh, base. Uh, you, you, you may see from the last page, uh, over our registered users is over 110 uh, million registered users. And also our market, uh, we operate in the China's uh, fast growing adult learning market. And uh, for our market, we have a strong demand for personal development and the concept of life lear lifelong learning uh, because uh, also we uh, we launched our courses since uh, July uh, 2019, and we continuously focusing on the, uh, the cultural and spiritual needs of the adult person in China, uh, especially for the middle-aged and elderly people. Uh, you know, the current uh, trend for the Chinese population demographics is the is the aging population. So we have a market size of the senior adult learning market uh, by revenue, uh, you can see from the uh, slides, it's very uh, big number. Uh, we have the, uh, we have a forecasted uh, market size uh, in, uh, in maybe uh, in 20, sorry. Our market size of the senior adult learning market by revenue uh, has grown from RMB uh, 9.6 billion in 2018 to RMB 28 billion in 2022 with a CAGA of over 30% uh, from that period. And also you can see the age, because of the aging population trend, the senior population in China uh, will, will rise from 18.7% in 2020 to over 28% in 2040. So the demand for diversified and enhanced courses, uh, which have very uh, easy to understand and affordable uh, nature is very popular among such kind of population. And also the transition from the offline to online, uh, driven by the technological advances, uh, will, uh, will also uh, support the growth of, of our market and the revenue. And currently, uh, our solutions is uh, through uh, during the past four, over four years of uh, growth and development, we we have grown uh, to uh, as the China's largest learning platform, offering uh, personal interest courses, and also we have a diversified uh, course offerings and an in-house develop content development team, and also the uh, our uh, exceptional online learning experience through a very unique uh, service-driven dual instructor approach and uh, online community training. Uh, so during uh, leveraged by all of this, we have a faster evolving technological uh, infrastructure, infrastructure built for the uh, business scalab scalability and also the business development in the future. So to summarize, we have a key two points. Uh, one is that we our diversified course offerings uh, position us for robust long-term growth. And also our scalable business model uh, facilitates the rapid launch of new initiatives, uh, including both the courses and also other uh, initiatives, which I will elaborate in the following slides. Uh, be, uh, for our uh, personal learning courses, the individual learning business, uh, we have major we have many uh, three kinds of uh, courses. The first is the skills upgrading courses, uh, applying our test and skill approach and to effectively and e uh, efficiently iterate our course offerings. 
uh, for all of our courses, uh, our uh, latest number of the learner satisfaction rate, which demonstrate the interaction and the uh, like uh, the customer satisfaction with our platform uh, reached over 98.5%, uh, which is a, a very high number. Yeah, and also we have the second uh, kind of uh, type of courses. Uh, this is the financial literacy courses, which we launched in uh, the earliest one we launched in uh, July 2019. Uh, so we have, uh, you know, in China, the financial literacy rate is relatively lower uh, compared to that in the developed countries, including US and the UK. And also the uh, market uh, is very uh, high growing and also uh, leveraged by our uh, operation and our uh, management of the cost during whole processes we have uh, we have achieved a very high rate of repurchase ratio uh, this ratio have consistently remained uh, at approximately uh, 60 percent and above for past six quarters uh, which demonstrate a very uh, stable uh, customer satisfaction and also uh, they can uh, interact with the platform uh, very closely. Uh, this is the recreation and the layer courses, uh, which is uh, newly developed uh, in June 2022. Uh, and up to now, during the past uh, nearly two years, uh, we have achieved a very uh, high growth for this kind of uh, courses. And also this kind of courses are mainly tailored uh, tailor-made uh, to our middle and senior uh, aged people. Uh, our such kind of learners, uh, uh, we, have to, uh, we have to cater to their specific needs and also make uh, the contents very uh, enjoyable uh, so that they can enjoy the interaction with our tutors and contents and also uh, they can enjoy the time with our platform. Uh, and also leveraged by our experience, especially the live streaming, uh, broadcasting, live streaming, uh, lecturing, uh, technology, and such kind of uh, operation experiences. Uh, we are expanding our revenue streams and enhancing our profitability to uh, test and scale in the uh, live e-commerce area. Uh, the first uh, majority, uh, major uh, SQ we are testing and scaling is a Chinese liquor. Uh, in Chinese, it's called Baijiu. So it's a very popular product among the mass public. And also based on the uh, demographic profile of our customers, uh, we, uh, we try this kind of product. And also we are uh, a part of this. Uh, besides, uh, we are also uh, testing and, uh, our other kind of products and services through the live e-commerce. Uh, especially the live streaming tech technology. Uh, for example, we tailor made uh, the products uh, according to the uh, course contents. Uh, for example, for the personal well-being courses, after that, uh, we will uh, deliver some uh, products, some uh, healthy products to uh, cater to their uh, the learners' needs. Uh, so that is also a kind of our live e-commerce uh, business. Uh, this is the uh, introductory uh, for our uh, business process. We have adopted an innovative learning journey leads to a stronger user engagement. Uh, typically, we deliver and we offer the introductory free course courses to the uh, mainly through the live streaming uh, methodology uh, to over, we, we have the ability to cover uh, to over 100,000 learners at a time. We developed this system by ourselves. And this system and uh, this technology can afford a very high uh, capacity to deliver our services through the live streaming. And also through the whole process, we can interact with learners in real time. And it's a very interesting and enjoyable time with our learners. After the introductory free course uh, period, uh, we 
uh, convert some of the free course learners to our premium course uh, learners, and also we adopt uh, online uh, online training camp. Uh, this, in this community, in these online classes, uh, we deliver our uh, course contents and we deliver our services uh, to the online course learners uh, during uh, some period of time. Uh, and also uh, through a um, combination of methodology, including the live streaming, lecturing, and also the online uh, tutoring and online, the WeChat group, uh, uh, WeChat group discussion, and also the tutors uh, you know, guidance, uh, the online class community uh, have, have a very uh, healthy and interesting uh, experience uh, for the learning journey. Uh, for this uh, slide, uh, we started to develop the system and develop the contents by ourselves then since the launch of the business in 2019. So currently we have a, a cultivated uh, in-house content uh, development team and also the monitoring system. Uh, for the IT uh, system-based uh, team and the methodology, uh, we have uh, cultivated a very systematically uh, systematic uh, methodology to deliver and update the contents to our learners uh, so that to make it uh, updated, make it interesting, make it understandable, uh, especially uh, to make it uh, acceptable to our uh, mass public uh, learners uh, so that we have a very uh, satisfaction ratio uh, rate with the learners and also our re repeat purchase ratio and also the growth of our uh, users, uh, number of users, all demonstrated that we have a very uh, solid methodology and uh, platform to attract the users. Uh, this is our, uh, we have a all of the methodology, all of the system technology, including the updated, the, the recent very hot topic, the AI technology, uh, all of that are uh, developed uh, based on our internal team. Uh, we have uh, developed the live streaming system. Uh, we have developed the intelligent study two case with intelligent system, business operation technologies, uh, so that we, we can make it a very efficient uh, business operation process to deliver our services so that we can make it uh, profitable for the, for the platform and uh, acceptable and uh, interesting for the learners. Uh, so both are winners. Yeah, apart, uh, besides our individual online learning services, we also have updated our uh, uh, business model to cater to the enterprise uh, demand, uh, for example, the marketing services and also the enterprise uh, training uh, services for our corporate partners. Yeah, this is a, a, our growth strategy since our launching of the platform. So all of our strategies uh, proved uh, successful during the past two quarters. Uh, especially, uh, you can see the uh, for for these quarters results, uh, our grow uh, user base strategy and also the course offerings uh, and also the enterprise services, including the new initiatives, including the live streaming e-commerce and uh, other services is growing very fast. Uh, so we continuously invest in technology and data analytics, especially AI technology uh, for their application in each uh, possible uh, aspect of our business operation areas so that it can improve the uh, efficiency of our uh, platform and also uh, we can uh, find some new business opportunities. Uh, for example, for our short video production courses, uh, we provide the learning services, uh, we provide the guidance, the classes for our uh, short video production learners and also besides uh, we uh, provide some AI uh, tech, the AI tools. Uh, currently, uh, cooperating with with our partners, and also uh, we are using uh, this methodology to uh, to sell and to provide uh, AI tools for our uh, learners. 
And also we are attracting and cultivating talents and also we, we are expanding our overseas and pursue strategic collaborations, uh, new business opportunities uh, in both domestically and especially for this year, uh, we are expanding our uh, business in the overseas market and hope that we we'll deliver new results. Yeah, so to summarize, uh, we are the largest uh, in this unique uh, China uh, elderly, uh, middle-aged and elderly uh, learning market. Uh, and also we have a, a strong uh, growth trajectory uh, during the past and also in the future. And we have developed an innovative learning journey uh, leading to strong user engagement uh, so that we have a very large user base uh, making it a uh, very great potential for new uh, courses delivering and also new business uh, opportunities with such kind of users. Uh, we are developing uh, new business initiatives uh, endeavor to serve the uh, large user base to serve their needs. Uh, so this scalable business model uh, will drive rapid launch of new course offerings and also business opportunities uh, and also the robust technology infrastructure and uh, we have a very uh, dedicated uh, visionary season, season management team and entrepreneurial corporate culture. Yeah, this is some of our uh, awards from the from the public. We cooperate with the we have very uh, harmony uh, harmonious relationship with the society and also the our learners and institutions. Yeah, this is our financials. You can see from the past, we have a very strong uh, registered users growth, and also we have a very strong uh, paying users uh, quarterly year-on-year -year growth. So this is our uh, diversified revenue stream. You can see that our uh, new initiatives, our other services also contribute uh, a significant part in the recent quarters. Yeah, we have, uh, so the adjusted net income uh, is just uh, between uh, between the adjusted and non-adjusted, uh, the difference is the uh, uh, share-based compensation expenses. Uh, so for the adjusted net income, it shows the uh, normal operating results. You can see from the past quarters, we continuously delivered a very positive result. Yeah, this is our cash reserve over uh, 1 billion RMB. Now this is a uh, operating cash flow. Uh, this is a yearly uh, uh, figure uh, because we only uh, do the net cash, the cash flow statement for in our annual report. And you can see from the past three uh, fiscal years, we always generate positive net cash and operating uh, cash flow. Uh, we have no debt since our launch of the business and we have very uh, healthy uh, operating cash flows. Yeah, uh, this is a uh, detailed financials. I think uh, you may, you guys may have some information on our uh, publications, uh, including the 6K. Yeah, uh, I think it's over and thank you for your time. If you have any questions, I'm happy to discuss. Great presentation, Tim. Thank you so much. Fascinating. So tell us a little bit. I'm very familiar with Coursera, Udemy, and others. Yeah. Um, what's the difference between what you offer and those online courses? Oh, thank you. Uh, I think uh, for Udemy and Coursera, the, uh, I think basically the contents are different. Uh, first, uh, I think first is the contents. Uh, I think for the Udemy and uh, Coursera, they deliver, they offer the courses, uh, mainly focusing on the certificates, the skills, uh, especially the hard skills uh, for their, for the learners, for the students, uh, training, they may get the degree and they may get uh, the job need skills. Uh, so uh, for our platform, we only currently offer the interest-based courses. So that's the major difference, I think. Uh, our learners uh, choose our uh, online courses based on their own uh, interest. For example, our 
uh, the major courses we, we offer, uh, including the calligraphy, the piano, and also the short video production skills uh, for our up, skills upgrading courses. Uh, for the short video production courses, uh, you see there are many uh, Chinese people, especially the mass public, they use the uh, TikTok, they use uh, the short video social uh, platform uh, to maybe uh, both to do the do business. They may have the, their online shop. They want to attract the viewers. They want to attract the users. So they, they may need the skills to improve their short videos uh, to make that more attractive. And also for some, uh, especially for some middle and senior uh, elderly people, uh, they are very familiar with uh, with a short video production, a uh, short video uh, social platform, for example, the TikTok in China, and also the WeChat in China. Uh, they need uh, beautiful pictures, they need beautiful uh, videos uh, to post on the short video uh, social platform to attract their friends' eyes and their attention. So make it uh, enjoyable and interesting. So that uh, that is the contents uh, we deliver for our learners. So basically, I think we are the content creation platform uh, to deliver such courses and also services uh, to our uh, users. And also, uh, I, th I think this is the first major uh, difference. The second one is that I think the target learners and the users profile. Uh, our user prof profile is a, a mass public in China. Uh, you know, in China, we have a very large population. We have 1.4 billion people in China. So many uh, Chinese people do not have such kind of uh, so high level uh, degrees and we have so much kind of uh, advanced knowledge. So we have to make all of the uh, interest based courses understandable, interesting uh, in the way they can understand and they can enjoy. So uh, we have, uh, uh, and also uh, many of our learners uh, middle-aged and uh, elderly people. Uh, so you, you know in China, especially for the people uh, who are born uh, between the maybe the 1960s to uh, early 1970s, uh, they have a very, uh, uh, they, they, are, they, they, are, they are wealthy, they have time, but they are maybe feel uh, lonely. So uh, they need such kind of online interest based courses to cater to their personal life, to enrich their spiritual life, and to make it their personal life more uh, interesting and enjoyable. So that is the profile of our learners. Uh, but I think for Coursera and uh, Udemy, uh, their learners may be the college students, maybe some, uh, maybe some uh, uh, workers, and maybe some uh, people who need the skills upgrading and their skills on the job. So that is the major difference. Okay, yeah. well, thank you for that. I might have to check it out myself. I could I could learn a few things for my social media chops. <laughs> um, <laughs> I have a question yeah. from Kurt Moore. Kurt yeah. wants to know, is it any classroom learning or is it 100% online? Yeah, currently, 100% uh, online. Okay. Uh, but we occasionally organize our learners uh, offline uh, to make them uh, enjoy some social uh, networking uh, events so that they can enjoy the uh, the offline time for the online classmates. Uh, for uh, We deliver all of our services basically online. Uh, we have very uh, systematic methodology and platform uh, utilizing the WeChat uh, tool uh, to organize a very disciplined uh, online class uh, so that they can enjoy the the whole learning process uh, to organize a typical maybe uh, 200 class uh, 200 people on in one classroom the online classroom they can enjoy the time uh, to discuss they can enjoy time uh, for their homework to discuss the, the, the problems to interact with their classmates and uh, the tutors and also the uh, we, we, we will uh, we will do, we will examine their home, uh, their homework. Uh, we will score them, and we will uh, issue some certificate online. It's very interesting and organized uh, form of learning. And also, uh, besides that, we will organize some offline events and maybe some offline competition 
Uh, for example, we organize the competition for the calligraphy, the piano, the memory courses, so that you can uh, enjoy the offline time also. Wonderful. Um, yeah. Last question, only due to time, probably. You have a large user base. So um, how are you scaling your business to further leverage that large user base? Yeah, I think the key thing is to deliver uh, the services and, and products with quality to our users uh, so that the users uh, view uh, like our platform and stick to uh, the stick to our uh, products and services. So I think the key, uh, we are developing and improving our service quality using the technology, using our in-house in content development team uh, to make the contents, to make the service process more attractive and enjoyable for our learners. So that is the key. And also we have uh, massive and uh, we have the technology edge and we have uh, many, many uh, online channels to attract uh, new users uh, using our, uh, maybe the AI technology currently, we can uh, very efficiently attract the online traffic to our platform. And also uh, besides we are developing uh, new offerings, including the repeat purchase, uh, repeat purchase of the courses with advanced and more interesting courses. And also we are uh, developing the new uh, initiatives, uh, for example, live e-commerce uh, to offer some uh, interesting products to the cost learners. And also we are developing some new uh, consumer goods with live streaming, for example, the Chinese Baijiu uh, to cater to the uh, users uh, with the same uh, profile with the current user base. So that is our methodology. Wow. Well, Tim, we are out of time to keep this conference running on time. So many questions for you. Uh, we will send wow. them to you so you can answer on your own. But please come back. Give us yeah. some updates. We'd love to have you back on the conference. And uh, great work. Great job today. Yeah, I'm glad to that. All right. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. And we'll see you again soon. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, everyone stay with us. We'll be right back with Findex Technologies.